All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Shield Hero Season 2, Episode 11. In the last episode, we had uh, Raftalia become the Katana Vessel Hero Wielder, Weapon Wielder, um, however that name goes, uh, which is really sick. She kind of got an upgrade there, got fully kind of evolved um, quickly to back to her adult form, um, as well as now she's just hella stronger, it would seem like. Definitely a worthy kind of wielder for... Um, a sword, especially now that the fact that she needed a sword uh, in this world, and now she's got one hell of a sword. Um, so yeah, it's going to be really awesome. The, the, the team has definitely got a level up here. Everyone's back together. Really excited to see where it goes from here. So as always, guys, like the video if you like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, she is so tiny. Oh, and this is rough. Well, so she's never fought any waves before. Okay. Bro, they're stopping this man from getting sliced in half. Bro, this, this, this guy might just fuck you up right now. Oh, that's sick! Oh my god, that's funny. I can't believe he didn't listen. Um, somehow I doubt that, but pop off. And the boat vessel has brought them back. Very nice. Whole squad here. God, after all this, I really don't think they can go back to being enemies. This guy seems cool. What were you doing there? Yikes. Well, the thing is... <laughs> He's avoiding the scolding. <laughs> He's a king. Interesting. I want to meet the cardinal heroes of this world. Because the, these three, like Glasslock and um, goddamn chick whose name I keep forgetting. Um, they aren't cardinal heroes. Like, we've got Kizuna as a cardinal hero, but what about the other three? Or well, however many there are. She's so small. She's almost the same height as Philo. Bro, he's going to bring him back after he's just sliced in half? Oh, he's going to fuck these guys up. <laughs> Your majesty. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's clearly po uh, popular. <laughs> it's, in it's interesting that even though the vassal weapons are supposed to be kind of pick the wielder at random, that uh, a king got picked. Bro, why is this, like, blacksmith so goddamn hot? Holy fuck. <laughs> Wait, uh, she's able to, like, take that from her? I thought vassal weapons couldn't be handed over to other people. It needs to be done in a night. Yeah. You have to bring him some extra help. Oh god, what the fuck is this? Um, hello. Is that a vassal weapon too, or...? Because if, if it ain't, you are clearly outmatched here. Yeah? You just popped up on them? For real? Even the blacksmith's like, fuck off. For a low-level Philo is going to deal with her, I swear. Oh, thanks Jigglypuff, appreciate it. You might be right. No, just deal with her, who fucking cares? All the people he's fighting are like, what the hell kind of fight is this? Yeah, send in the katana. Make this quick. Is her weapon a vassal weapon? I don't understand. It seems special. Yeah, let's hope it stays that way. Locke's a cool character. Bro, this woman better just give up. Holy shit. What is it doing? Like, draining her power or something? Kyo made this sword? Yeah. Figures. Oh, her hair's changed colour. What the fuck? Why has that happened? Oh, it's like combining with her. What the hell? Oh no, it's draining her life force. Bro, what is this wild ass sword, man? Whatever it is, absorb it into your shield. <laughs> oh, so the sword kind of just wanted to wrap them up, kind of tangle them up, and then just blow up, it seems. 
noble goal. Okay, dude. He just take. He wants to take out the other world, doesn't he? Stop the waves. Yeah. Okay. And. Why bring her to our house? <laughs> I mean, you still got her in handcuffs. What would be the difference, like? Yeah, for real. <laughs> But, but what? I'm gonna take his ass out. I doubt it. He's a fucking nut job. Do you know that, Kizuna? Are you listening to him? Yeah, you better figure out a way for Kyo to not die in this situation before Nalfami pulls up on him. Are you just gonna leave her alone? She can't hurt her. What if she, like, tried to jump her or something? Ooh, who's this? Uh, okay, so Lark, Teddy's Glass. So there's two on the sides, which are kind of black, blanked out. Maybe they're vassal heroes, or maybe they're actual cardinal heroes. I'm not sure. Mm, interesting. It's completely normal. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> it's a house. It is a home. I suppose Kizuna's got quite a trusting face. Mm, so she's actually known him since he was young then, so he, he really, she really does know him. I completely forgot actually, Kyo being a vassal hero, not a legendary hero. He's not actually someone that was reincarnated from Japan. Oh no, uh, sent over from Japan, sorry, not reincarnated. I forgot they never actually died. Yeah, he did, yeah. Good. Yeah, but if it comes to it, we'll fucking defeat him. Kizuna, so you need to get that in your head. He has to atone. Even if we're put to death? Okay, I like that style. In a single night. Goddamn, you look good considering you probably haven't slept. Bro, she is a pro. Wow, that's cool. Oh, now she's got a place to sheath the weapon. That's awesome. Oh, Fila looks so cute. Fila pajamas. Yeah, I can imagine. I can't believe she didn't make you pay up front. Because <laughs> he's the king. <laughs> That's what you get. Bro, this Uber ride go crazy. Wait, what is it? Countdown? Oh my god, it's speeding up. Is it speeding up? Bro, what is this dude doing? Bro, he's forced the wave to start. Why? What's well, a good job you've got all your equipment. Are they being forced teleported? Bro, bro, what? Oh, it's because of the waves. Holy shit. Oh yeah, it happens when the where, when the waves start. The heroes get teleported, and now for me, he's not there. All right, well at least we know we can kill him now. That's fine. I'm pissed that now for me, he's not here. Fuck. All right, so that was episode eleven, season two of Shield Hero. Uh, very interesting episode. Really looking forward to this now. The the fact that Kyo is confirmed to be a very very bad guy, as to which we already knew. Um, but Kizuno kind of needed that little bit of extra to really show them that, no, there's not really any worth talking to this guy. We should just kill him. Um, yeah, I'm wondering as to why it is his goal to spawn the waves here. I don't freaking know. Probably some like, oh, I was bullied as a child or some bullshit. I don't know. Um, but yeah, a very good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Hopefully now for me can reunite with these guys so he can help with the waves too. And yeah, as always, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Please subscribe if you haven't already and like the video. And peace out, guys.